I'm making kit lap. Hello, everybody. Welcome to our fun science. And today, we are going to talk about blood. So we're going to get inside and look what's in the station. <laughs> We are going to do a blood model in a bottle experiment. We are going to use a clear liquid hand soap, okay? This washing soap, but this one we pour. We use this one so we can see clearly the components of blood. So we pour some in our bowl. Yay! For our red blood cells, we are going to use our red jelly beans. We want this one in macro to represent our red blood cells. So red blood cells contains a special protein called hemoglobin and then red blood cells carries oxygen from, from our lungs and distributed throughout our body. Red blood cells contain about 40% in our blood. Okay, so there you go. Look at that. Isn't it pretty? There you go. Okay, so we now have the mixture of plasma, the red blood cells, and we're going to add our white blood cells. Right now, I'm using peanuts. So they're peeled peanuts. So in every 700 red blood cells, there is at least one white blood cell. So this will represent our white blood cells. White blood cells. So our white blood cells is our guard cells. Also called leukocytes, which helps us protect from diseases. Our body, okay, so that one. Lastly, we are going to put our platelets. So these are uncooked rice. This is an uncooked rice. So this will represent as our platelets. So platelets help us for our wound healing and many more. So we are now finished with our mixture. We are going to put this in our bottle. So we have the it's like a mineral water bottle and I made my own recycled funnel. <laughs> So we don't need to buy. So let's put this one here in our bottle. Oops. So we are here, the red blood cells. The kids will surely love this one because they love to play. Yay! I'm going to put in this one.
Thank you for watching. Don't forget to thumbs up and subscribe.